almost always. It's sunny right now, so we're making the most of it. True, but maybe tomorrow. So behold my newest invention. I call it the Robo Umbrella. Wow, it looks like a regular umbrella, but bigger. And it's made of metal, so it's extra strong. It will certainly block the rain. And it totally blocks the sun. So, since it's not raining, I'll take it down. Ah, <sighs> thanks. No problem. Hmm, needs more wind resistance. Hello, rainforest. What a gorgeous day for a swim. Amazon River, here I come. Yay, swim! <gasps> Lily, I don't think you want to do that. Why not? The water looks perfect. Uh, we don't know what's in there. Yes, we do. Water, the kind you go swimming in. But that might not be all. Lots of things live in the water. Why don't we go find out? We'll take the polo pod. It's, it, it's kind of squished in here for three polos. Actually, four. Hello. I don't see a problem. The Amazon River looks like a great place to swim. What's that? It's an otter. Otters are so cute. They're huge. They're giant otters. It says here that they're called river wolves. <gasps> they hunt in packs? They're skilled predators. They go after their prey in groups. Oh, look, it says here they eat caimans. Okay, no swimming with giant otters because they might attack us. Let's take a look underwater. Yeah, whee! This doesn't look so bad except for that stick. That's not a stick. Aw, don't worry, Gorby. It just means we get to hike some more. I love to hike. Hiking is great, but I want to get to the waterfall. Me too. Everybody does. So let's get hiking. That waterfall is here somewhere. We just need to find it. Yeah, but how are we going to do that? A frog. Huh? A frog? A poison dart frog! Wait! Wow! Guys, look! There's another one! Aww! It's so cute! And tiny! Ooh, careful, Nash. Poison dart frogs are one of the most poisonous animals in the world! It carries its poison right on its skin. You wouldn't want to disturb an animal in the wild anyway, Nash. Such bright colors and cool patterns. Oh. Wow. I wonder why they're so colorful. Most other rainforest animals try to hide or blend in. So what's their deal? I think they want to be seen. Maybe because the skin of the poison dart frog is where all the poison is. Its bright color is actually a warning to any animals that try to eat it. I get it. The color says, hey, back off. I'm poisonous. You don't want to eat me. These frogs are amazing and all, but what about the waterfall? Okay, okay, Gorby, we're going. Whoa! Hey, guys, look! There's tons of boys and dart frogs. Wow! Wow! Ooh. Wow! And they're on the move. Where do you think they're going? Well, frogs are amphibians, and they like to be around water. So while the rainforest is a wet environment... A waterfall would be even wetter. You think they're headed to the waterfall? It's a creature, a deadly one, too. It's an electric eel. An eel that's electric? Seriously? How is that even possible? Electric eels have special body parts that make electricity. They need this to help them hunt prey and defend themselves. What's that? Oh no, there's another one! That 
that's not an eel. That's a snake. A ginormous snake. How many things live down here? Well, anacondas do. Right, Chester? Yep. They're the biggest snakes in the world. They can grow to be as long as a school bus. That's big. Do they bite? No. They coil their bodies around their prey and drag them into the water to eat them. Cool. But no swimming with anacondas. Absolutely yeah. not. No. How about here? It looks beautiful. No giant otters, no electric eels, no anaconda. <gasps> Ooh, fishy, fishy. Little fishies. Piranha with the sharp teeth that can eat whole animals super fast? Yes, but these red piranhas bark to warn other creatures to stay away from them. Woof, woof, woof! Cute otters that don't want to play? Eels with electricity? Giant and a conscious snake that squeezed their prey? And barking piranha fish? The Amazon River doesn't seem like a good place to swim. Yeah. But this is where they live, their home, not ours. The Amazon belongs to the creatures that live here. Sorry, Lily. Oh, I don't care about the rain. If only I could find some place to swim. If I could just find one place, any place to go swimming today. Well, how about this? I was working on the robo-umbrella, but then it started to rain, and it turned into a swimming pool. Yay! Thank you, Willa! Cannonball! <laughs> Who wants to play Marco Polo? Woohoo! Yeah! 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 <laughs> Marco Polo! <laughs> <laughs> we can follow them and find out. Well, we couldn't be any more lost than we are already. So let's get hopping. These little frogs really stand out in the big jungle. <laughs> yes, but so do you. <laughs> This way or Zaz way? Which way? Which way? I don't know, Nash. Look. Poison dart frogs. Follow the frogs? Follow the frogs! Come on, Polos! <laughs> 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 I think they're eggs. It looks like this is where poison dart frogs come to lay their eggs. They're so close to the water. The baby frogs. Tadpoles? Right. Tadpoles must drop off the leaves and into the water, where they grow up to become poison dart frogs. Cool! Poison dart frogs are amazing! See, Gorby? I told you we'd find the waterfall. And all we needed to do was follow, follow the frogs. Frog up, frog Organization. That's what we need to get all our stuff back into the polo mobile. We just have to act like the ants. Okay, remember, everybody pick up the first thing they see, bring it back to the polo mobile, and put it away. Then go back out and pick up another thing and bring it back and put it away. Just like the ants. Just like the ants. Let's go! Ah! Ah! Oh! 
you to lift, Nash. We little ants. Big. Ants can carry 50 times their weight. That's like you carrying 50 Nashes. <gasps> Hold on. We'll help, too. Yeah, and here we go. Now we just have to get it inside. Actually, I've got a better idea. How about lunch? Oh, yeah. Hungry. We carry it so we get to eat it. Yum, yum. But we don't have to turn it into goo first. I'm just glad it's not fungus. <laughs> <laughs> yeah.